ran one errand tonight, and there were literally just a handful of sprinkles on yep, my windshield. Just a few droplets yep. in there. It felt uh, a lot better uh, today than it did yesterday. You know, Amen. guys, it was so hot at Bandwagon mm. last night, there was a concertina malfunction. Mm. It's that hot. It was so, so hot. humid and How hot. How hot was it? <laughs> it was brutal. Uh, how about that shot? Uh, our own Mitch Keegan was out of Thunder of Drums tonight. Beautiful. And got that beautiful uh, sun, kind of a sunset. It was probably 7.30, 8-ish as yeah. the sun was going down. So they maybe have to change it to thunder. There was no real oh. thunder no. out yeah. there. No Just real thunder. Just on the field. You can feel it. A lot it. of drum thunder. Yep. Yeah. A lot of that. Uh, our Almanac got to 70 for a high today. Uh, big, big difference from yesterday. In fact, check out our high temperatures today. This is uh, across uh, Minnesota from the 60s, 70s. We got the 70 in Mankato. There were low 60s up in North Dakota. Compare that to where we were yesterday. This is our high temperature map from yesterday. 90 in Mankato, St. Peter. So 20 degrees cooler today than we were yesterday. And it's still a really nice evening. 64 wind out of the east at seven. The dew point has dropped considerably as well, and I think you can see just a little bit of a sprinkle that was uh, on the ground there, just a little bit, not much in the way of rain. In fact, nothing picked up here in the gauge at the TV station. 64 now, New Alma at 64, St. James 61, Wasika at 63, St. Peter 65, Redwood Falls, our current temperature now at 63 degrees. We have high pressure to our northwest. We have a cold front that moved through yesterday that brought the relief today. The issue for the next couple of days is a big upper level low that's going to be sitting over the Hudson Bay, and that's basically going to spin a few fairly weak systems through our neck of the woods over the next several days, and that's going to bring multiple chances at scattered showers and thunderstorms across much of Minnesota. You can see out here to the west, a few showers and thunder showers are continuing to develop. We have a couple blips here uh, near Redwood Falls. Uh, Wyndham Slayton area, a couple of showers and thunder showers continuing to develop now west and northwest of Marshall. All of that's going to gradually move off to the southeast here as we make our way through the night tonight. In fact, this is our hour by hour forecast. As we take you through about 1.30 in the morning, we're going to continue to see showers and thunder showers. We'll see some developing along I-90. More kicking into the west late tonight by 4 a.m. We'll see those move toward Mankato by around daybreak. There could be some rain first thing in the morning. The clouds will get out of here. We'll have some sunshine and then another round of showers and thunder showers could develop tomorrow afternoon with uh, another quick shot of rain into the evening. So that's something we're going to watch closely. And then as we head into Thursday, we may catch another isolated shower, thunder shower or two on Thursday afternoon into Thursday night. Let's uh, get to the forecast tonight. Scattered showers, maybe a thunderstorm, especially toward morning, our low 59 tomorrow. We're going to get to about 77, partly cloudy. Could be some thunderstorms right away in the morning and then again in the afternoon and evening as we take you to Thursday, an isolated thunderstorm, a little better chance of scattered storms on Friday. After that, it's done. The weekend's going to be sunny and pleasant with uh, warmer, dry weather kicking in as we hit uh, mid next week. And that could last for a while. We might see a stretch of hot, dry weather here next week and beyond. So something to keep in mind as we roll along through summer. Yeah, hopefully the grass will get a little bit of water for yeah, then. We need to get some. It's not going to be a lot, but there will be places that do get rain kind of spotty. All right. Sounds good. Thanks, Sean. Be right back. This 10 day weather forecast is brought to you by Bongars. What you need when you need it.